Our planet is amazing. It's a fantastic place to live in. It's also the only planet we have and for future generations we better look after it carefully. We at Volvo Group have always had environmental care on our agenda. And we are now stepping up the game, making sustainability and circularity totally integrated into the core business. Today, I'd like to invite you to a guided tour in the Volvo Group Circular Operations and Solutions, showing one cornerstone in our sustainability journey, the remanufacturing process. Even though our products are tough, reliable and made to withstand the toughest operating conditions, there might come a time when a part needs to be replaced. Then, if you want to make a difference for the environment and at the same time protect your investment, Volvo Reman would be the perfect solution. Remanufacturing is a standardized industrial process by which old worn-out products, cores, are returned to same as new or better condition and performance. Basically, returning something like this into this. Within the Volvo Reman program, a wide range of products and solutions are offered, including everything from engines and transmissions to battery packs, diesel particulate filters and electronic components. All of them brought back to life through remanufacturing. How about the business model? Well, it all starts with a customer approaching a dealer. Upon the decision to buy a remanufactured product, the dealer will place an order and the distribution center will supply. Dealer installs the remanufactured product in the customer's application and takes care of the core, the old replaced product. The core is sent to a core hub, collection centers within the reman program. From the core hubs, cores are distributed to remanufacturing plants where they are brought back to a second life. From the remanufacturing plant, remanufactured products are supplied to the distribution centers which closes the circle of life for our products. Buying a remanufactured product where the vast majority of the components are reused is truly a win-win-win concept, both for the customer, the environment and our business. For the customer, it means that the worn-out product can be replaced with a high-quality, latest specification, remanufactured product with same as new warranty. All this at an attractive price and off-the-shelf delivery. Altogether, this means that remanufactured products are contributing to lower total cost ownership, better uptime and preservation of the vehicle value, thereby protecting the customer investment. From a sustainability perspective, Remanufacturing is a true enabler for a transition to a more circular economy, striving to reuse products and materials instead of scrapping. This is what remanufacturing is all about, and it means in practice that we can reduce energy use and CO2 emissions, as the energy needed to remanufacture a component is just a fraction of what it would take to mine, refine and produce the corresponding new component. With remanufacturing, we will also preserve raw materials and avoid landfill, as most material will be reused and the fraction that's replaced will be recycled. For the Volvo Group, customer satisfaction is key. Through the Reman program, we can assist our customers with everything from today's products to older ones that are no longer produced or just hard to get hold of. This at a reduced cost compared to new manufacturing, which allows us to explore and develop new technologies for the future. Remanufacturing is also a key source when it comes to reclaiming scarce materials, either as reused in our components or through our rigorous recycling procedures. To conclude, win-win-win is a suitable term to describe the remanufacturing benefits for the customer, the environment and our business. I bet you are curious to see how remanufacturing is done. It's done in our remanufacturing plants, and here I am, right outside one of them, so let's go inside and I will guide you through the Volvo remanufacturing process. Clearly, the cores are essential for the remanufacturing process as they constitute the raw material. Therefore, return from dealers is crucial, and throughout the process, the cores need to be handled with care. Cores within the reman program are returned from dealers to core hubs. Upon arrival, 
All cores are carefully inspected and quality criteria conformity is evaluated. Cores are entered in our core management system and from the hub they are shipped to the remanufacturing plants for processing. Once the core enters the remanufacturing plant, the first step for most products is a pre-cleaning operation of the complete core. The core is then disassembled into its individual components and the first inspection is done. Some components are automatically replaced for reliability and safety reasons. As an example, this goes for gaskets, ceilings, defined wear parts and everything that has been superseded with a product upgrade. Even the replaced and severely damaged parts are valuable and will therefore not be scrapped, rather recycled, thus contributing to circularity. Once the core is disassembled and everything that will be replaced has been sorted out, it's time for some serious cleaning. We have a wide variety of cleaning methods to choose from depending on the component material and level of contamination. Basically, we need to get from this to this, and we do have the means to do it. Every method used is chosen not only from a cleaning capability perspective, but also with energy consumption and environmental friendliness in mind. One widely used method is conventional washing, where hot water and detergents are effectively removing oil and dirt. For more severe contaminations and corrosion, blasting may have to be used. Working with more sensitive components, more gentle cleaning methods is required. In this case, we're looking at a soda blaster for electronics. Respecting cleanliness requirements is extremely important in remanufacturing, which is why we also have dedicated areas and clean rooms for processes that so do require. No matter the method, the outcome is completely clean components, ready for inspection. Every single component is thoroughly inspected for reuse and the point of reference is always drawings and technical requirements. This is one of many things that sets us apart from independent actors, as we have access to all documentation. We own it, simple as that. This basically means that there are no grey zones, either it's good to go or it's not. We have got state-of-the-art equipment used by highly skilled operators to determine the condition of all components. And to mention a few examples, we perform visual inspection, advanced measurements, crack tests, leak down tests. The list goes on and on. And out of this step of the process, some parts will be possible to reuse as is, and some parts will require repair. Some parts will require repair before reinstalled in the remanufactured product. And this is what happens in the salvage step of the process. Let's talk a little bit about salvage. Salvage for us means to enable reuse of components, either through inspection or more or less advanced repairs. Salvage rate is a measurement on the percentage of reused components. High salvage rate means high usage of the core, something we strive for every day and through continuous innovation, we develop quality assured repair methods in order to salvage components for the benefit of the environment, our customers and our company. One way to restore surfaces suffering from wear, tear, damages and corrosion is to use conventional machining, removing just enough material to create the perfect surface. In some cases, material needs to be added, which is why we operate quality assured additive equipment. We also perform crack repair, weld repair, sleeve repair, thread repair, and many more. What it all comes down to is that within the remanufacturing process we do all we can to salvage as many components as possible and we have spent decades refining our methods. All salvage methods will bring the components back to drawing specification, making them as good as new again. And all over and under dimension parts used in the process are Volvo Group in-house developed. 
this sets us apart from others as we own the data and in our salvage development activities we work closely with the Volvo Group engineering departments. Our engineers in product preparation are managing product specification, operation, governance and production support. The bill of material for a remanufactured product will be created here and also maintained over time, ensuring that the reman product complies with the latest product specification, incorporating all product upgrades. This is also where we create instructions, tools, training and information for our operators, all done in close collaboration with Volvo engineering departments, the persons that actually designed the products to begin with. The level of information that we have access to is unique. This cannot be done elsewhere. When replacing something, we only use genuine components that have passed the Volvo Group rigorous quality standards. The work order is completed with new components and by now we have a complete product kit where the vast majority is remanufactured, all good to go into assembly. The remanufactured product is assembled and all factory specifications are applied, whether it's tightening torques, settings or procedures. Even though we now have a product with most of its components being reused, at this point there is no difference from new as everything is brought back to specification. A remanufactured product is as good as or better than it was when it was new. This is something we say and we say it with pride. Not only do we say it, we mean it, and we back it up with thorough end-of-line tests before delivery. The remanufactured product would have to pass a test cycle simulating the toughest operating conditions while measuring various performance parameters. The product is painted, protected from corrosion, and packed to withstand transport and storage. It's not just any packing, we use dedicated racks, fixtures and packing material in order to protect the customer's investment. In most cases, the racks and packing material is also to be used when returning the core, which means that we have a circular approach not only on the product, but also on the transport and shipping elements. The remanufactured products are shipped to warehouse or directly to customer. Through the Volvo distribution system, the product will be delivered or stored for quick delivery. Upon delivery, the remanufactured products are ready to go straight out of the box. From a customer perspective, you've made a difference in the world choosing a remanufactured product. You've minimized the environmental impact and at the same time you're enjoying the benefits of quality you can depend on from a supplier you can trust. We managed to turn end-of-life cores into as good as new products. A remanufactured product contains up to 85% salvaged material and through the remanufacturing process we're saving up to 80% energy compared to new manufacturing. We're also avoiding lots of CO2 emissions and saving money for our customers. You have seen some advanced machines and equipment in this film, but I would also like to be very clear on the fact that this operation is built by people. We rely heavily on our very skilled and highly trained operators, proudly performing the craftsmanship of remanufacturing. Every day, the Volvo Group's products deliver food and medicine, take children to school, power irrigation systems and construct roads and buildings. Keeping this world-class transport system sustainable calls for a more circular approach where remanufacturing is one key enabler, because in remanufacturing, every end is a new beginning. Let's keep this planet amazing. Let's keep it a fantastic place to live in. <laughs>